wonderful to be here today. Why do people vote for the political parties that they do? It's a very basic question. Um, but it's important in the context of Africa because of the young democracies that are across the continent. Um, and in young democracies, we commonly have non-institutionalized political parties that don't necessarily have robust relationships to voters. This is also consistent with the narrative on the African continent that politics is primarily ethnically driven. However, this is clearly the case in some countries, but clearly not the case in other countries. I focus on a group of 12 countries where the first political party in power at the time of national independence, sometimes over 60 years ago, is still in power today. Um, so what explains this dominance of a select group of politi political parties? Um, while some of them use autocratic tools to remain in power, many are simply more popular than their opposition rivals, sometimes by a factor of five to one when we look at partisanship rates. Um, to try to explain this, I uh, select two countries for my case studies, Botswana and Zimbabwe, to look at a democratic and autocratic um, performer that falls within this group of 12 uh, ruling party countries. I focus on uh, countries that had national liberation struggles and where the political party is now branded with patriotism and nationalism in the eyes of many voters, giving them an advantage over opposition parties. Another uh, explanation that I explore are the competitive advantages that some ruling parties uh, maintain through traditional cultural values, specifically uh, prevalence of um, hierarchical governance, collectivism, and spiritual authority that gives some of these rulers added legitimacy over opposition parties. Thank you.